If your car has stayed outside this past week, it likely has a nice coating of yellow on it. So do our pets. I wipe <laughs> them down and it's yellow. It's that time of year where pollen wreaks havoc on our vehicles and our allergies as well. CBS 17 storm team meteorologist Brian Hutton Jr. explains the pollen on your car, not what makes you feel so bad, though. The abundance of yellow and green on your car is a clear sign that we are firmly in the middle of pollen season in North Carolina. The pollen, though, that's on your car is likely causing you to rush out to get a car wash every week, but it's not the reason why your allergies are going haywire. The yellow on your car is pine pollen, and it is too thick and heavy to get into your nose. Because pine trees drop large pollen molecules that quickly drop to the ground and coat everything, it doesn't stay airborne to get in your nose. The real culprits are your other trees, grasses, and plants that are coming back to life. The pollen from these plants is usually released in the morning between 5 and 9 a.m. and is worse on windy days where they can stay airborne longer. Just as our face masks have become important in the fight against the coronavirus, the same masks can reduce the amount of pollen you inhale through your nose, minimizing your allergy symptoms. Masks are not the permanent fix for allergy sufferers, but they can help reduce how often you take your antihistamines. Meteorologist Brian Hutton Jr., CBS 17 News.